The final part of the equation is wattage, and that's something folks are more familiar with. Uh, wattageology? Yeah. In the past, it was commonly thought that watts was a measure of the lamp's output. But as we just saw at the top of the label, lumens is the measure of light output. Watts is actually a measure of the electricity consumed to operate the lamp. More energy efficient lamps, such as compact fluorescents and LEDs, can produce the same amount of lumen output as incandescent bulbs while using less energy, or watts. Knowing the lumens and wattage from the package label, consumers can select the most energy efficient replacement for incandescent bulbs by following this simple method. Find a lamp that gives you the same amount of lumen output as the bulb you want to replace and requires the lowest number of watts to operate it. That will be the most efficient replacement lamp. By the way, there may be one additional listing on the label if it applies. That's the amount of mercury contained inside the lamp. This would pertain to compact fluorescence, where a very small amount of mercury is used as a starting aid. Make no mistake though, the banning of the incandescent bulb is right around the corner. You might say it's lumen fast on the horizon. You might, but let's not. I think we just want to recommend that the next time you visit your lighting retailer, take time to read the new labeling and start upgrading your lighting today to more energy efficient and longer life lamps. Help create a sustainable future for generations to come without sacrificing good quality lighting. For more information about Sylvania lighting products, visit us online at sylvania.com. And thanks for listening.